So I think it's going to get lively. I think because there is a, such a contested gubernatorial race, contested attorney general race, contested county executive race, the one, er one area, Valerie, that you and I, I think agreed on is that there will be a voter turnout this time. And I, a, a voter turnout is still relative. It doesn't mean that the majority of the voters are going to be out there. Still, a lot of people will sit it out. But compared to 2010, there's going to be a lot of excitement at the polls. You've got the unions taking taking stances, not necessarily for the same candidates. Or they get a lot of uh, voters out. They get activated. They do a lot of the campaigning out at the polls. Um, I think it's going to be a pretty well, uh, a pretty a pretty good turnout. I would say this time around compared to four years ago, for sure. Well, you said lively. What's going to liven it up? Is what I'm I'm wondering. Do you know something we don't know? Is there a bombshell going to drop? I think what I think what you're seeing is is everything stays close. The tension. Uh, really, the emotions between the candidates. These are folks that have known each other for a long time. Um, it starts to get a little bit more personal as you get closer to the election.